Hey guys, welcome to the vlog. We're in central Hong Kong and we're here for a comp. And yeah, this is like a national qualifier meet. So your meet the main intention is to qualify and qualify for a national championship. Again, the goal is to become two times national champion in Hong Kong. So we're here for the qualification. I uh, don't want to speak too much right now because I'm a bit tired. I'm going to wait 20 minutes to make way. And I haven't had water since morning. So yeah, we'll take you guys along the rest of the day and then I don't know, my brain's frozen, but let's go. So yeah, coming into this competition, I think this is one of the most confident that I've ever been heading into a competition. Sampai Kura managed most variables because they were going to compete with each other. Seven years plus and then sappai variable or manage by just to feel bad even though work was busy uh, i feel like training like the utmost priority rakhera nai hamle gari ra thyo ani felt really really good weight pani i think the best weight that i've ever made like normally i end up losing too much weight i know tar yo pali chai weight pani like thaka 109.5 109.6 uh, yoi range ma uh, weight gari ra thyo so i was expecting uh, to feel really really strong this week it almost felt like 300 is going to fall today. I actually know my 300 going to come within uh in the squat and then uh, that was the intention. Oh, nice. Ye balen banu hunde na competition ma. Oh, I know. Hopefully nationals ma chai hunchu wala. Nationals da bol qualify hunchu esma. Yo testo like high reward meet pani hai na. So nationals ko bela chai banu pani hunchu wala. Aile hamro like I think kusto dimag pani hamro thik thama nai cha relatively but then like so many things happening like banu level like aile pura naya different ti bhana i think like thailand ma chai like so chill out kina bhane dimag ma nai training garne khane ma tai thyo nda tete bela for like two weeks only training and khane ma tai bhairathe and kathmandu aune bittike like so many things happening ke and like this gym ko naya ma gym bani ra cha last one month ma tai ab soon opening ko lagi we have to get everything right and then there's So we opened the squat with 272.5 kg, which is also 600 pounds, and that's uh, pretty much the heaviest opener that I've ever opened with. Right? was literally a weight that would crush me down just a few years ago and then now think about it like 600 pounds so like i just entered the 600 pounds a few years ago and then now i'm opening with it and it feels really really light so it felt really really light and ever since like your competition ma we've been training i've been training the number 300 has been on my mind because you know like this prep line i'm i'm just calling it mission 300 i need that 300 kg squat and i definitely felt strong enough to do it today so we went for 287.5 kg on the second attempt after So 287.5. It felt the lightest 287.5 has ever felt for me. Just to think about it, like last time, more nationals go on the kiri. My top end was 290, and that was an absolute grinder. <laughs> so considering that like we like like our plan suggested we uh, loaded up 300 Oi ayo tu se tu se tu se andar no history in making
ตัวเวิร์คอิสดอนตัวเวิร์คอิสดอนทูเอดีไฟฟ์เพอร์ซิงเกิลคอยเลเบนี่ไอทิงทูเอดีไฟฟ์จัสต์ทักเกอร์
it happened in a blink of an eye. Like I was squatting, like I was just thinking about squatting 300 and then it's my time already and I cannot squat it. So benchmark, my focus was with my uh, game day handler, uh, Kenneth. He literally saves me every single time uh, I'm here. I cannot be more grateful. But then benchmark, I wanted to, you know, get in a PR bench because Squat to our boys, okay, okay, gonna miss, you know. You fall down and then, like, you try to forget about it and then uh, move on to the bench press. So, benchmark, the goal was to uh, not miss and then gather a total. And that's what we did. We opened 145. 145, And then that's how it went 152.5. This was my best competition PR in a national championship. Uh, all right, uh, bench, bench press, not my strongest lift for sure, uh, but then we're putting in the work. Uh, I'm uh, gonna go for 157, or uh, maybe this is gonna be something around what I can do for the competition. Uh, but then bench, must like something that I've worked really, really, really hard because for the longest time, I've always struggled with uh, making progress in the bench press, not like the squat and the bench press, the squat and the deadlift. So yeah, let's do 157.5 and see how it goes. <laughs> Come what? You did it? My I was meant to say, and I was like, Golly, hey. Ambo. Well, can I say my light? I was not to see you. You just say. <laughs> right time. Ma bhai ra nervous bhai like. Whole life unsa tha? Haan, yeah, whole life. Oh, he's watering about it. So just okay. Oh, he's watering like dinner. Sabko ki sabko na.
एउटा साइडमा स्पटर पनि छैन एउटा स्पटरले बताउँछ कि बताउँछ कि थाहा छैन तर दामी नै भयो दिस इज अल द वे फ्रम एभरेस्ट आदिले लेखेको एभरेस्ट ट्रेक जान्दा गिफ्ट लेख आई थिङ्क लाइक ब्याङ्क मैले अघि भन्दै थिएँ लाइक मेरो यस्तो कमजोर लिफ्ट हो अनि लाइक कति भयो गरेको अनि त्यही पनि लाइक त्यस्तो भनेर भन्दै थिएँ आठ वर्ष It was never a time when bench was like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> mera bench dhami cha wana, uh-huh. khal se kaile ban thena. But then again, tinte khatra ba venta, atti wale ba venta, nanti ba venta. Tinte dis, tinte, tinte, tinte wana, thale ba venta, that would be crazy. I think bench lete keeps you down to earth. I know, grounded, it keeps you grounded. <laughs> Maybe a bench. Two, two point five up, silver on top, silver on top, rack height. then uh, finally uh, 157.5 kg and then like the whole prep my squats been so good but then my bench was absolute trash like agadi ko conversation with me happening like why why the wala like it wasn't good like we were to you know just uh, get a token bench and then i was really worried about standards in the bench because i wasn't <laughs> lifting to standard i'll be honest with that Can't. <laughs> come on, come on. Yeah! Yes. Oh, But then bench showed up. Uh, five kgs PR. Hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. White light. Yes. 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 <laughs> Uh, it like lift garda khere it always like looking back it's always so easy like eh eti garnu sakthyo hola eh tai le esto garnu parne eh maile esto garnu parne but uh, i don't we don't dwell in the past uh, we put like aile ko situation anusar ke best cha haina so tei hamle halera we did 157 and then we moved on to the deadlift God deadlift ali got the rusty so because like we made changes try to make changes and very fit down the heavy it's not the same anymore but then total effect garne gari weaker just right now but i think this is towards what i should be aiming like maybe another 5 to 2 and a half kilo jump 300 would be cool <laughs> like i've i've loaded 300 pretty much every single meet uh, the last 3 4 meets that i've done every single time uh, 300 load gare cha actually gare Uh, but then to bring it all together uh is 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 tough is tough
I've been chasing 300 for such a long time. Um, 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 um. It's to, it's to face boy say get 300. Sangha. I've chased it like God knows how much just to lag me boy say get. Ani, itti hype, itti hype great baat hai. Like whole Nepal gori ne. Like my le pay la 300 gorsa, my dali 300 gorsa, or like 300. God knows how much just to lag me. Exactly 300, 301. It's to hype boy say get. Ani the hype se lagera bani kya pugi say get. My the dimag ma bani. Like I've done it so many times in my mind. That it feels like I've already done it, but I've not really done it in a full, full mean. Uh, so I, I don't know 300. I've been playing that team mean or something like that. Now, Peri got that here. Just a lakh, I'm like, I don't know. Costo one to 300 because your number to 80 so that's bro. Like 80 so that's 80 so that's it. Actually, got it, buddy. But I don't know. Uh, I don't know what it means to me anymore. It's just that I wanna uh, be able to do it uh, on the platform. So we opened with 275 kgs on the deadlift. Nice! For those who didn't know, that was 600 pounds. The first time I deadlifted 275 was uh, in 2020, 20, I would say. And then deadlift's just been on a hit and then like it's just you know it, it's the lift that sort of makes me doubt if i should even <laughs> continue to do it because like you know we put in so much effort into this like every single time we're training we're pushing the limits beyond what my body is like it's hurting all the time we're putting it so much emotion you know like i don't know if you can relate but then uh, when you love something so much you're so passionate about getting into the end goal and you put everything on the line you know you could risk a major injury like every single thing and then train religiously for such a long period of time uh, but then when you don't get the results it really i think makes you question if this is even the right thing for you to do or for me to do but then like you know i try to stay unhinged unbothered by that idea because i know like if i <laughs> stop training or like stop deadlifting my life would be even more miserable just in a bad emotional state so you know a lot of emotions coming into my body's tired i cannot feel my lower back anymore <laughs> but yeah we opened 275 and then we moved on to 285 kg <laughs> By this time, I was pretty much done already. I had nothing more to give. I had given everything that I had in my body, every single ounce of muscle, every single pound of grit every single you know measure of everything that i could give i had given everything and then which secured me the first place in this competition to win and then uh, it was a 730 kgs total extremely fast competition done and dusted in less than two hours <laughs> <laughs> I think for me really like Untani I think like no matter what I've done like Untani like oh, no matter what how much effort that you put into it sometimes like even if you are doing all the right things things don't align in your favor and then I'm not the type of person or like any like anyone that's around me is not the type of uh, person who hold we hold like a really really strong belief that you know no matter what we're not going to give up I know it's really difficult for me because like like I said, like so much of effort and everything. But then we're not somebody that would back down from a fight. We will take up any other challenge that there is. And then I think uh, this is just a small little roadblock because at the end of the day, the medals don't mean uh, anything if I'm not making self-improvement, right? And I think uh, in this part of the story, it's not about physical strength, but then more emotional gains 
more you know mental gains a big big learning experience because everything we do we either win we either lose but then at the end of the day we learn and then what I really really love about the sport is that no matter what you do you're in the highest of the highs like when I deadlifted 300 it's the same thing you rest one day and then you get back to work now uh, not in the highest of my highs but it could have gone worse uh, I, I can tell you that much it could have gone worse but no matter what even if I bomb out from the meet one thing is uh, common I don't know where I went from that but then one thing is for sure that you rest one day and then you get back to freaking work and that's what I will do. This is not the best version of myself to portray. But then, you know, we have our days and we don't have our days. This was just one of those decent days. But like I said, we will get back to work. We will put in the work and then I will not make any fake promises here. Like I will do this, this and that. I will show the work and then you guys will see it. And yeah, uh, thank you for watching. I don't know how this would be. Maybe a bit negative. I don't know. Who cares? Thank you for watching. Alright guys, wrapped up the week, gold medal, drop tested, 7.30 total, 2.5 kg for the idol. Uh, uh, not the result that I expected, uh, in terms of total, but I think all in all we come here to win and then we'll be done. Thank you for watching, see you.